The Vario Aero is the king of clarity of virtual reality. This headset has simply the sharpest visuals that consumers can get in virtual reality right now. However, it did still have some problems with distortions at the very edges, warping. Now with software version 3.5, this has improved a lot. And in this video, I'm going to show you through the lens comparisons of before and after applying that update. And at the very end, I will let you know how you could win the Vario Arrow. So absolutely stay tuned, watch the whole video because all of this goodness is coming up. And we directly start here with our through the lens footage. What you see here is the arrow without the distortion fix applied. So this is the before video. And as you can tell how the, yeah, the top is gobbled up here by that kind of warping distortion, this is a problem. By the way, I'm filming this through the lens and this is at the very, very top of your peripheral area. So this is something that you normally cannot see so clear and that's also why the shot is not super clear, right? Anyways, I wanted to show you how this looks like and here with that table tennis net, you can see that distortion really well. It's super, super obvious. So remember this scene because you are going to see the exact same scene in a moment with that new distortion fix applied. And this is just by the switch of a button in the Vario Aero base software. And now we're looking at the extreme right side of the lens. And also here is some kind of warping. Check out the, the lines of these medium and hard boxes. You can very clearly see that kind of distortions, right? That kind of fish eye effect at the very edge of the lenses. So yeah, that is a problem. Now, this is with the distortion fix applied and you see it looks much better. Well, we still have that kind of chromatic aberration here these kind of rainbow colors, but you will not see that when you actually wear the headset. It is just much better. This difficulty, right, this text, it was like gobbled up completely with that distortion fix not applied. Now it looks much better. But now let's have a look at that table tennis net. And I think here now you can really see the difference a lot. You don't have this kind of crazy distortions anymore at all. And I'm telling you, when wearing the headset, you will not see any of this anymore. Without the distortion fix applied, yes, you will see that something strange is going on in the top of your peripheral vision, but this here, it's so good, you will not see anything anymore. So again, I must remind you, everything that I'm showing you here is at the very peripheral area of the vision. So now let's see the right side here and let's check again those boxes, medium and hard. So you see much better. There is still like a little bit of distortion going on, but as compared to without the distortion fix applied, this is so much better. And most people will not even feel that at all when they're wearing the headset. Again, this is like pointed through the lens at the very edges. This is only in your peripheral vision. You So you will not see it as clear as you see it here now. All right, now it's Beat Saber time. This is Beat Saber with no distortion fix applied. And check out the B and the E and the A and the T, how much they are getting deformed here on the very top of your peripheral vision. So yeah, you could see that. You could see, hey, there's something funny going on here when you're not using the distortion fix. By the way, I totally forgot to mention that my name is Sebastian Ank, and if you appreciate that independent and honest reviews of headsets, then you absolutely must subscribe to this channel and click on the bell button. Yeah, right, should never forget that. So let's also have a look here at the side and also here, you can also tell that there is distortion going on, some kind of fisheye effect on the very edges. Here, check out the T for example, how that changes now the A Right, so you can see that, you could see that, you could see something is going on and that could pull you out of the immersion. So therefore, we should now apply the fix 
the switch of a button. Now before we still check a bit here at the top. <laughs> so remember how that looks now. And we are going to apply that distortion fix in a moment so that you can see the difference. Okay, now, now the distortion fix is on. And yeah, so the, the Beat Saber, right? Those letters, they are not deformed in a way that they were deformed before. And again, when you're wearing the headset, you will absolutely not see any strange things going on, right? There's still probably a little bit of a distortion, like a little bit, but you will not see it anymore. Before, you could see it. So that is really a huge, huge improvement. And I think it's great that Vario is still improving that headset with each and every update. Okay, let's uh, have, a, have a look at the side, at the very right side now as well, to, to compare it to before. So you might remember, <laughs> like one minute ago, <laughs> we also looked at it and we did see quite some deformation, quite some distortions. And now I honestly can't tell here when when going when looking at these um, yeah beat saber letters and again it's just because of that great new lens distortion profile with the vario base software 3.5 and by the way do let me know in the comment section do you want some more through the lens videos where i don't show you that extreme peripheral vision but yeah the middle what you normally see when you look through the lens and do you want to see something like against the Reverb G2 or against the Quest 2? Do let me know in the comment section. And now we're having a look here at my desktop. This is again without the distortion fix applied. And you can tell that there is quite some funny things going on here <laughs> at the very top of the peripheral area. So this is something that you could see. You could see there's something that is simply wrong and yeah check simply check it out how it looks also here at the very right side or here here you can see that extremely well now right with that edge how strongly it deforms when that fix is not yet applied so let's see it now when we have actually applied it so now here again with that fix applied and again this is just not sharp because it's really tough to take through lens videos of that peripheral areas. But for you, I made it happen. Now, while you're marveling at that through the lens footage, <laughs> I simply want to let you know that there is a cool Vario Aero giveaway running and you can find it on Twitter. Simply find at Mixed Reality TV. That is our Twitter handle here at MRTV. And yeah, you might stand the chance to win a Vario Aero. And in my opinion, after that fix is applied, like now, <laughs> it's a really amazing headset. The sharpest visuals and now distortions are not a problem anymore. Really nice. And that's everything that I got for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed this through the lens footage. If yes, give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you have not yet subscribed to MRTV yet, then absolutely do that now and click on the bell button so that you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And I'm looking forward to see you in the next episode. Don't forget to leave a comment for the algorithm so that more people can find us. Until then, bye-bye.